The federal government says it recorded $21.9 billion of diaspora home remittances in 2022 through its official channels. President Bola Tinubu, represented by Honorable Femi Badjabi Amila, Chief of Staff to the President, said this at the 17th Annual National Diaspora Day 2023 at the Conference Center, Presidential Villa, Abuja. The theme of the day was Consolidating Diaspora Engagement for National Development. The theme for this year's celebration, Consolidating Diaspora Engagement for National Development, is apt. Our country is emerging into a new dawn of dedicated efforts to ensure national development, guarantee peace, and promote prosperity for all our nation's people. The ambitions we had in this regard cannot fully be realized without the support, contribution, and enthusiastic participation of those of our brothers and sisters all over the world. As such, all deliberate efforts will be made in this administration to ensure that the Nigerian diaspora community are intimately involved in designing, implementing, and reviewing public policy plans and programs. With these in place, we are well positioned to accelerate the development and implementation of programs to ensure that the Nigerian diaspora community are fully part of the ongoing nation-building effort. While, in, uh, whilst it is gratifying to see fellow Nigerians succeeding in faraway lands, I am also hopeful that in this administration, we will be sufficiently successful in our plans to make Nigeria a place where the best and brightest of us can succeed and thrive through the works of their hands. On this occasion of National Diaspora Day 2023, I want to reiterate to you my commitment to do everything that I can as your president to make our beloved country the destination where the best dreams of your heart can be achieved and where there are no limits to the inspired ambitions you carry in your heart and in your spirit. May I also let you know that this new uh, democratically elected government is a diaspora-friendly one, which will provide an enabling platform. Will provide an enabling platform for effective policies for the diaspora, with a view to galvanizing support for the new administration and concretizing our democracy, setting an ex excellent example for other African countries to follow. Keeping in mind that our highest obligation is the welfare and well-being of all Nigerians everywhere. I congratulate all Nigerians in the diaspora and those at home on this occasion of the National Diaspora Day and Diaspora Merit Awards 2023 celebrations. May God bless and keep you all. In her welcome address, Mrs. Abike Dabiri Erewa, Chairman Needcom said the theme of the day was a summary of the entire mandate of Needcom. So let's look at our theme this year, consolidating the diaspora engagement for national development. It's not only appropriate, but it's a summary of our entire mandate as a commission, which is to engage and harness the talent, skills, resources, and global exposure of Nigerians in the diaspora for national development. Our interactions with the diaspora community during this year's National Diaspora Day celebrations, therefore, I expected to mobilize the diaspora to key into some of the programs of the government and to chart improved and better ways on how to achieve positive results for national development within the renewed hope agenda of this government. The rich academic professional Global exposure and various contemporary experiences have already placed our diaspora at an advantage. I'm therefore enthusiastically waiting to have you empty yourselves intellectually and generously to, to enrich the delivery of our mandate for the development of our dear nation, Nigeria, for the diaspora. We all know that many countries all over the world all across the continents of the world have evidence and testimonies of accelerated national development of their diaspora that have truly enhanced their diaspora resources meticulously and particularly uh, towards socio-economic growth of their countries. Such efforts by the diaspora 
actually do impact very positively on national development. And we are here to ensure that Nigeria is not left behind. And I want to thank our diaspora who are gathered in this hall, who are watching virtually, for making us proud. This is who we are, hardworking, efficient, brilliant, intelligent, developing world economies. And we're saying that you can do the same for your country, Nigeria. In his opening remarks, Ambassador Adamu Lamuwe, Permanent Secretary, Minister of Foreign Affairs, applauded the Nigerians in the diaspora for their contributions in Nigeria. The annual diaspora day set aside for the 25th of July every year is meant to specifically commend and celebrate the Nigerians in the diaspora for their contributions towards nation building. This is why this year's team Consolidating Diaspora Engagement for National Development is not just out. It comes at the inception of the new government of His Excellency Bola Ahmed Tinubu GCFR, President, Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, who has shown from the outset a business-like disposition to uplifting the socioeconomic well-being of Nigerians, wherever they may reside. Highlight of the day included a cultural performance by the National Council for Arts and Culture, a musical interlude performed by Christina Ibokwe, granddaughter of the late Nigerian musician Christy Essien Ibokwe, a saxophone played by Aurel for Sax, among others.